Good morning and welcome back to my channel. So, today we're going to be doing a mini haul. Only a mini haul because it's not yet payday but I got bored so I wanted to do some shopping. And today's choice is Pretty Little Thing. And I absolutely love that shop and there is discounts and everything which is obviously my cup of tea because, well, who doesn't love a good bargain but yeah. So I'm going to be showing you, I only bought three things this time and it came to £43 altogether instead of £90 it was reduced from there and it had free next day delivery so I was like you know what this is great so I bought two dresses today all still in the packs two dresses and a skirt which if you look in my wardrobe all you'll see is just little black dresses which you can never go wrong with a little black dress but it's the only colour I've got so I thought maybe we'll go with something a bit different, we'll go with a bright red because, you know, it's nice to be bold sometimes and I absolutely love royal blue. So I've got, well it's actually like a royal blue, maybe a navyish type of blue and it's a lace dress which I absolutely love. And then I've also got a utility skirt because I normally go for like jean skirts or just little floaty skirts so I thought this might be a nice change. So I'll get ready in the first dress and there we go. Two days later, and as you can see, I finally got into the dress and it zipped up, which thank you mum, because I can do it myself. So, it's only two days later because there are two dresses that I ordered. One was this one, and oop, one was this lovely blue one, which I need to do up now. Right, so I ordered these two dresses and I'll try on this one now for you. I've already tried them on and I'm going to speed that little bit up from what you can see because it isn't the best. You can see me struggling, I can't do the zips up, I can't do anything and those two dresses were size 10, both of them. The thing that I struggled with again and I don't know what's wrong with me today is the zip. <laughs> oh, it would look nice as a v-neck, uh, v-back or just an open back. But I did struggle again with the zip. I don't know if it's me or what it is. It's I personally am a size 8 to 10. Like, 8 on the top, 10 on the bottom because I'm not very gifted in the booby area. But, I'm a bit bigger on the bottom area. But, these two sizes didn't actually fit when I went to do it with the zips. I couldn't do them properly. Whereas now, even with my mum's, like, I tried it with my mum's help this one in the size 10, but it didn't work. So she suggested I order them in the size up. I'm not normally a size 12, these are my only clothes in a size 12, the skirt fit fine, that was the size 10, that was perfect and I absolutely love it and I'm going to wear it today anyway but the two dresses, I have had to size it up, I don't know if it's because of the body contrast or what it is but I'm actually a bit happier because the size 10 I ordered of this has a little bit of fraying on the side by here which means that can go back and I got this one which is lovely and new this is size 12 and I love it. The only thing is that this is a little bit tight and a bit restrictive on the bottom. However, it's a nice longer fit there as well. The sleeves are a perfect length for me there. And once again, it's not too tight on the top or anything. I just absolutely love this dress. And it was still in sale, so that's fine. So I'm going to stand those two back and keep these two. If I were you, I would size up on these two because it just makes it more comfortable. And if you're like me and like to eat a lot, if you put on one or two pounds, it's still going to fit you, so that's fine. And I don't know, it just hugs your figure a bit better as well, I think. Like, the other ones did, but maybe it was a bit too tight. Like, looking back now, maybe it was a bit too tight, and I don't know. But I still love it. It's got really nice detailing on the side. It was only... This one was £18 from... No, this one was £15, reduced from £35 from Pretty Little Thing. The blue one was £18 reduced from 35 So I've still got a sale and I still had next day delivery. And I absolutely love this one. It's very, very pretty, very flattering. So this is the next one. Also bought in a size 12 to make up for the size 10. Because that one I also struggled with the zip. This one I've done no help, no assistance, no mum. So I'm really happy with this one. The length is really nice and unlike the red one which is a much thinner and lighter and softer material this one is quite heavy material so it's quite warm the only thing I'm not sure on is the length of the sleeves like yeah it's quite nice but I don't know I much prefer a shorter sleeve or I don't know 
I'm not too keen on the length of the sleeve though. But I do like that it has full coverage. You can't see my underwear right now. Same with the red one, you can't see my underwear. And once again, it's quite a nice detail in by here. However, with the size 10, it was not, it's not too bad. But with the size 10, it was quite in, so you can't exactly see any pokey outy bits. Possibly it can't show, whereas this one, it does sometimes show, which isn't the best. But hey ho, most said we'll get some titty tape for it, so that's fine. But I really love these dresses. This one was really, really cute. I love the lace pattern, and it's not just with the red one, it's just lace, it doesn't have anything underneath it. This one has a little end, a nude under suit. I don't know what you call that, but a nude like slip underneath. So, whereas this one doesn't have the band to keep it from coming up, if it does come up, you'll just be faced with the nude under slip thing. I don't know. But I really like this one. I prefer the red one. I, I love the red one, but I also love this because it's really nice to go with my skin tone. So. So my final purchase of the day is this utility skirt, which I think is absolutely, I don't know, I love this. And as you can see, I have managed to do the zip up, so I'm not a complete fail. It is working sometimes. Don't know what's wrong with me, but you know what? It's fine. But I love the colour as well, because it said it was like a stonish, creamy colour, which I just love. I love the material, it's really soft. The waist is a bit, it's a bit big, but I like that because then it just, it's not pulling in too much, it's not showing off things that you'd like, obviously I can wear it with this and I don't feel uncomfortable, it's not, if it was pulling in even more, you might have like lumps and bumps coming out, which I'm happy that it doesn't. I love the popper detail, so we've got two in the top by there just to secure it, or you can fold it over or do whatever you want with that. And then you've also got poppers all the way down the skirt by here, which also come undone. But I love those as well. Oops, sorry. I love those as well. And they have got pockets on the side as well. Also popper details, which are really cute. I love that it's kind of a smaller one on the sides. It's just, I don't know, it makes it more cute, I think. It's just, yeah. And they're actual pockets that work as well, which I like that because this, um, like I've got a pair of cargo trousers and it's got pockets on the side like this one, but it's just not a pocket, you can't even undo it, it's just like that, and that's it, you can just not even put your hand in it, not even a finger in it. But that's, you've got two, one on each side, I love the shape of it, I love, that's the thing that I love about skirts, some skirts, right, so I go to Primark, or Primark, or whatever it's called, I don't know, I get told off either way but some of the skirts with me they just kind of like they don't emphasize your behind they just go straight after it and I don't really like that like I feel like I need something to hug my figure on the bottom which is why I go to jeans like mom jeans or anything like that because I feel like they show off and I don't know I just feel like oh look at me type of thing I don't know but I really really love this skirt it's really pretty it's really comfortable you can sit down and it's fine, doesn't come too tight, you can sit up, it's not restrictive. Like, I could pair this with a pair of ch um, shorts, not shorts, um, trainers or heels or whatever. It's really versatile. You can wear it in winter with tights or you can wear it in the summer. I just, I love it. It's really, really pretty. And this was £10 reduced from, I want to say 20 Yeah, from 20 I think this is absolutely worth it, one of my best buys so far, because I find that when I have no money, that's when I find everything that I like, and this is one of these things, so when I finally got money, I was like, oh, okay, we can get it, and it's on sale, which I've probably said sale a million times in this video, but I love it, and I am really happy with it, so, yeah. I just don't understand what this is for. It's been on a lot of skirts, and I just don't understand. I don't know. Best, there we go. I hope you like this video and I hope you can like, no, let's try again. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and comment if you have any suggestions. Tell me if you've had the same problems with the zips or if you managed to do it because you're not a mug like me or if you've bought anything similar, if you have the same, like if you enjoyed it, if you feel they're really soft or just any comments you've got, bring them my way. 